Hi guys, I'm here to show you a recipe I have for for your scalp. It's for your scalp for here, for this here. So one thing I have learned throughout the years uh, from salons, because I get my hair done in the salon. I don't do it myself. I did one time myself and I was scared and that was to color my hair. No, actually, I did color my hair twice. One was burgundy, and then one was is when I did the highlights. That was scary because that's something that you should do it at the salon. You should not do it at home. Okay, so uh, this is good for your hair, plus the pills. You know, you got to take collagen for your nails. You got to take collagen for your hair. You got to take collagen for your face. And there's different types. So you do have to take your vitamins okay according to applying applying and consuming it okay for your hair okay so this I consume it I take it in vitamins and I put this on the food as well so this is a cooking spice but this is also for your hair this is also for cooking and for your hair and for a tea you can make a tea out of this and you consume it and then rose water is also for cooking and it's also for uh, applying it to your hair. Uh, almond oil is also good for that. Coconut oil and organic oil is also good for your hair uh, and also for cooking. So this stuff is all good. Now, I'm not saying this one you're going to go ahead and whatever, you know, just you got to check out the recipe and whatever. But this one is for my hair and it was also for something else I got it for something else I don't remember what it was okay so uh, and I have I don't have these ingredients on my mask I have a hair mask which is is made out of avocado it's made out of avocado okay and if you see it's green because of the avocado so every time an avocado is about to go bad or when, when, when you open a avocado and it looks so like black, I don't throw it away. I, I put it on here. Okay? You can also use the, the seeds of the avocado. Chop them up real tiny and use them for that. You can blend them and use them on the mask for your hair because that is very good. I use it. As a matter of fact, I have it here. Now, uh, this stuff. Okay, so I'm going to do this right now. So I'm going to put a little bit of rose water. I'm going to put the coconut oil on here, okay, because I'm going to put it on my hair, alright, so this is the coconut oil, okay, right there, organic coconut oil, okay, you got to check for the expiration dates, because everything expires, rose water, okay, rose water, okay and it smells good almond oil now the the oils everything that has oils cannot stay in your hair for too long either so 30 minutes take it out okay 30 minutes and then take it out I'm gonna take this off because it's gonna be okay Put it back. There we go. All right. Now, these conditioners and stuff, you're also not supposed to leave it on your hair. You're supposed to wash it out because it does damage your hair. It dries up your hair. So, um, okay, just an FYI, all right, and then you mix, you mix glando with that, and then you're going to apply this to your hair. You can also blend this, and what it does, I'm going to, it calms your hair, it calms your skull, that's what it does, it calms your skull. Uh, it takes dandruff away. All these, all these does. Okay, 
I'm gonna tell you right now what it does. Um, oh my God, where is it? Right here. So the almond, the almond. Donde está el almond? The almond, it moisturizes the scalp, okay? And, and this one, it adds, it adds shine and smoothness to your hair, and it smooths the scalp, okay? And the coconut oil, it smooths the hair and increases the shine, okay? So, so over here, I don't think I can switch to show you, but over here it says that that you should not leave the conditioner on. You should take it off. I don't know if you can see it, but it says leaving conditioner in your hair for too long can cause hair fall breakage and scalp irritation so you should take it off you know you apply for 30 minutes whatever when you do a mask this is a mask I do it for 30 minutes and I do it like every like a month monthly is what I do I don't do it all the time because that's also bad okay um, honey honey is good for your hair honey has both uh, here, I'm going to show you. I don't have my glasses on. I can... Okay. So honey is good. So I believe I have honey on my mask. So that's going to play out. Because this is going to go with that. But I don't want to mix it together. Okay, now what I have in here is stuff that... I have a workout, but I also have the stuff that I buy when I go get my hair done. Uh, and I say, um, my my stylist, because I have highlights, California highlights on my hair. Uh, she suggests to uh, whatever she's putting in my hair, whatever, to better my hair, to be more healthier, because my hair is healthy. Uh, now, the reason why sometimes on my videos you see like white little things and stuff like that is because I don't wash my hair every day. I wash my hair every three days. Washing your hair every day will also dry up your hair. So, uh, I try four days. I can't do four days. 